commencing operations in Victoria Island, Lagos, and only recently opening its doors in Ikejajiare, Lakeshore Cancer Centre is the first operational facility in Nigeria solely dedicated to cancer prevention and treatment. Uh, Lakeshore Cancer Centre was established in 2014. Uh, several people came together to set up uh, a facility that is completely dedicated to cancer prevention, treatment and education. Educating other healthcare personnel about the causes, the detection, the treatment of cancer. Letting people be aware that cancer is not a death sentence. Our staff has always been our strength, reflecting our mission, which is providing compassionate cancer prevention, treatment and education. We started with about 10 members of staff, evolving to our current staff strength of over 45, both clinical and non-clinical staff. Lakeshore Cancer Center is the oldest cancer center in Lagos and in fact in Nigeria. So this is the first center that opened as a private center that specializes specifically in cancer care. And over the years, Lakeshore has excelled in this field. Lakeshore is unique because actually, at this point in time, we do not have medical oncology as a specialty in Nigeria. And I have moved to Lakeshore as a medical oncologist trained in the United Kingdom. Our services cover a wide range of cancer care, including diagnosis with our lab and imaging unit, screening of the four preventable cancers, surgery, chemotherapy, immunotherapy, palliation, nursing care, GP service, numerous health outreach events, an active mentoring and internship program, as well as an active weekly multidisciplinary tumor board team. So Lakeshire is unique in that it's, it's not, it's the people that make Lakeshire, not the building, the equipment, the space, um, none of that. It's, it's actually our unique set of hardworking, empathic, passionate, a medical and administrative team that have actually made Lakeshore who we are today. They're truly our rock stars and they're going to help us make Lakeshore what it can be, which is the leading cancer centre in West Africa. Our education, awareness and advocacy are next to none with regular conferences, health fairs, webinars and a foundation, the Foundation for Cancer Care in Nigeria and West Africa, which currently funds cancer care and screening for indigent patients. I see within the marketplace there are quite a few new oncology centres being set up in different places. So together um, we, will, we will battle this cancer and um, make sure place a small part. We do have four cancers that can be screened for and are actually preventable breast cancer, cervical cancer, prostate cancer, and colorectal cancer. And the whole idea of screening is actually to detect things early when something can be done. Lakeshore is designed as a cozy, comfortable space, offering some key essential services like consultation, chemotherapy, laboratory work, and admission for acute and palliative conditions. We did uh, research and we found out that most of our patients reside on the mainland. So for this, we listened to our patients and then we brought in our centre on the mainland, which is the new Ikeja branch. You can go into an environment or an establishment, you look at the structure from the outside. The structure is really attractive. It didn't look this beautiful when we first got here. There was a lot of construction work that had to be done, a lot of renovation, a lot of breaking down and you know remodeling going on. And at the same time, we had an already perfect site functioning in VI. We have two major factors that you talk about risk factors in cancer. We have the genetic susceptibility and environmental factors. dream ultimately to be, will be to have cancer centers all over the country and probably all over West Africa. Um, Lakeshore plays a small part of this 
Um, Ikeja is literally, literally springs up from that whole philosophy that we just do need to take care to the people rather than the people coming to care. If something is small, it's easy to cure. Ignoring it out of fear does not make it go away. So it's better to deal with the problem, pick it up, get cured, and then you can spend the rest of your life with your family.